Hey, who you trying to run faster than? Hold up. Damn. You don't run Hold up. You got them short ass legs. You ain't supposed to be running faster than me. I bought the game leg. Slow your ass down. You are taking the white card. You are taking the white card. You are not a white person. You're, you're not you're not the black man anymore. You're the white man. <laughs> you're the white man now. Here we go. What's up, huh? What you want? Professor, have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? Uh, yeah. Aside from those along our path. Not that I recall. What? What are they? Evidence of the keeper's efforts to manipulate the power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, and I usually am. You should be able to use them to inform and it. enhance your own magic. Thank you, sir. I will look out for them. Oh, yeah. Well, I like it. Oh, I had something in my head, but it just didn't come out. Oh, the fall of the game. No, that don't, that don't work. Never mind. Don't hear me say that. Okay, I, I, I mean, I like, I like the... Why am I walking like that, bro? It looks weird I'm walking like that. This was my swag in the beginning. Oh, yeah. I'm an upgrade nigga now. You see, I'll... Bro. He's a friend. Yo. It seems What's wrong with her voice? Terms with him. I've known him for years. She was not talking... When I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. <laughs> she was not was talking like that. Enough, but we weren't friends then. She had a whole female His voice. Who is this? This is a nigga. You're friends now. We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. This is a nigga. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. It took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. But this is a nigga. Lord is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards. Even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him but who in, is this? you'll find an ally in Lodgok. Thank you, Serona. If you find Lodgok, please this is a... give him my best. Who is this? I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies, but please, oh my, watch your back. Oh my goodness, bro, that's a dude. I did that. Don't mind me, I was just sleeping on the floor. I was tired. I had a hangover. So I drank too much. Lay like, y'all fucking class is bullshit. Niggas got niggas gotta climb a whole ladder just to get to your class. No one's supposed to make him out of gym. He tired as hell. Gee, God damn it, late. Like, okay. <laughs> Oh, ew, man. Sneeze up all over my screen. Where my fresh ass at? Yeah, my fresh, my, my fresh ass was in the cussing. It's crazy. You don't need to look both ways when you got swag. I hope those assignments... I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Ryan. Yes, I had to fight a whole bunch of well things. Done. Although I must admit... I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. <laughs> now, as you have I bet you did. sharpened your perception by completing I bet my you assignment, did. I am curious. Never heard that. Based never heard that from a woman. That one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come. What do you see in your own future? Uh, uh, uh. I see good things. After all, the future's mine for the taking, and I shall take what I must. 
Hmm. The future is not etched in stone. It can be carved out by those with very nah. strong wills. Nah. And you do I'll make it where I make it. One. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. No, I'm tired. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress. Oh, like two forties. I got a hangover. Exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. I bet you do. Channel your magic towards your targets. Shit. Oh. You have it. Now, why not practice the new spell on the tree? Oh, give me a second, ma'am. Give me a second. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come here, sir. Excellent. You're like, do you? I think you have it. Hi, <laughs> right, bye, lady. That man, you gotta go climb this whole ladder to get down here. Just jump down. I got, I got ankle insurance. Jump down. Oh, there we go. I told you I got ankle insurance. I'll upgrade the platinum edition. What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent. Outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class, mm -hmm. Summoner's Court isn't just a game. It's a battle of skill. A test of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? Akia. All in the wrist. Akio. Okay. Why didn't you do it the first time then? Okay, I guess it's bad. Time Not bad. Akio. Man, you cheating, cuz. You know he cheating. Nothing to it. Akio. Four. Fuck on my way, nigga. Yeah. Lucky shot. Akio. My ball's in the way, bitch. <laughs> Try to beat that. Down my way. Fuck. I'll let you have that one. Wait, did I win? I won. Don't sleep with my abilities now, bro. I had a lot of people that uh don't answer any of my abilities. All in the wrist. The bay is all in the wrist. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. Okay. Wow. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, come. On. Okay. That's crazy. Oh, your ball will be in my way. Oh, hold on. Hold on now. Come on, Leander. Oh. One for the ages. Up here. That's not like you ain't trying now, cuz. Nothing to it. Yeah, I just still win, you know. I could lose this ball right here. Up here. Yeah. I don't think you were trying to short. One. Well done. You beat me. I Bit of like, good luck, oh, that's all. It is. Come now, Leander. There's no need for that. Fine, you're good. Better than I am, at least. I'll let the others know you're good enough to keep playing. <laughs> you like the others? You like JC I lost seven matches in a row to Samantha Dale. <laughs> the others who play Summoner's Court thought that if you couldn't beat me, you wouldn't be enough of a challenge. Chin up, Leander. 
Keep practicing and you'll get better. I suppose you're right. I'll let the others know that your metal's been tested and that you passed. Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. There you are, That's a dollar over there. They are all in their own way dangerous. Especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Mm -hmm. Now, it seems many Big of you are in shit. practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care hey, for Hey, what that dog doing? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. New Hello. student? Do you like I'm a new student? Copy Sweeting. I don't give a damn who the hell you is. Professor you speech. make cocaine? She over-exaggerates sometimes. Shut up, I don't care. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. That shit look ugly as a motherfucker. Miss damn, that bitch trying to give you a kiss, girl. Attention, please. The tongue of a puff skin can be a slippery devil. Uh, yes, he's trying, he, he trying to get some of the action. Here, you can practice on Gerald. He was, trying, he was trying to show that tongue game. <laughs> what am I doing? Use my brush. Just be gentle. Brush. And think pleasant thoughts. What am I doing? I like to think it enriches his experience. Oh, okay, T. What? Oh, my God. Oh my god. It's lovely. I'm sure he feels much better. <laughs> I think he might be hungry. Hungry? Would you giving him some beast feed? Bro, what y'all got me? Come on now. Come on now. <laughs> I'm over here playing uh, 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 pet, uh, pet what workshop. What do you suppose the pellets taste like to Gerald? Like <laughs> shit. I like to think. How about I you? Think how you grab one? Let me eat it first and tell me how it goes for you. That's good news. He seems very nice. So you he fucking want to lick somebody? Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition and cleanliness. That thing like a Pokemon, bro. Good work, everyone. Now. Let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the Neasles in the farthest pen? This way. The Neasles are over here. Neasles? Oh, like, oh, like tigers. Oh, bobcats. Look at it. <laughs> that was a big ass cat, boy. Oh. Couple of knees or whiskers or Now you know darn good where that fence ain't holding them back, bro. Something from honey jukes. Stupid thing. He's like, boogie off me, I don't like that. What are you doing? Tus tus peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent. Her name is Persephone. <laughs> she get him up. Her name is Persephone. <laughs> That's really not funny. Actually, it's kind of funny. I don't know why my character said that. <sighs> Let's go. Her name was Persephone. <laughs> that big ass. Who's that fake ass? Fake ass bobcat. Let me get up in here with y'all. <laughs> so, what the? Yo, damn! Hold up, boy. That boy's on Dragon Ball Z shit. Me out of here, huh? Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me. I I'll play Animal Crossing. How did you find your first beast lesson? Um, school. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. I don't think so. You seem to understand that I'm not, when I'm, not my are words, properly okay. controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Yeah. Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in Rookwood's poacher pack. Yeah. Sadly, we're the ones who suffer. Stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. 
the Ministry? Perhaps? Not me. Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now, why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. Nick, I would not bet you that shit right now. Oh my god. Right, what you want, Wayne? Do you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to me. <laughs> I that again. So that I didn't have to. No, it's uh, again. Augury at noon in the desert. I that should sound certainly wrong. hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand that. I know he's saying Poppy. Poor thing. But it's not like he said Poppy. I. Actually, I in I, light of that, the Spanish version. someone I'd like you to meet oh, in the forest. I don't want to meet. It better be a, it better be a cool ass beast. Very well, lead the way. I so hoped I'm, I would. Well, I'm gonna slap you up when we get back over here. Hey, who are you trying to run faster than? Hold up. Damn, you run, hold up. The weather we're having. You got them short ass legs. You ain't supposed to be running faster than me. I bought the game, lady. Slow your ass down. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'm finna get that. That's a new Pokemon right there, cuz. What's that, Griffin? Is that a Griffin? Please meet High Wing. Isn't she just magnificent? Yeah, who this nigga? <laughs> Go on, introduce yourself to her. But be careful. I'm Nico Bella, aka that nigga. Always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. I do that. He's like, boy, you better know, you better know the details. But, <laughs> yeah, you do one thing, I'm pecking your eyeball out. Don't act stupid around here, bro. You better worry really about me. Yo, yeah. You ain't gonna bow down to you, motherfucker? Yo, yeah, there you go. <laughs> I knew it. I don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. You can feed and brush her if you'd like. I come and check on her every once in a while. He's like, oh yeah, get a spot right pasties, there. <laughs> tell her what's going yeah, on. Yeah, I can get a spot. Yeah, oh yeah. From looking at her, <laughs> but she's a dreadful busybody. He's like, oh yeah, what's that? What's that? Mm, 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 it's got a little taste to it. Mm, it's like chicken pool. Cool. Ah, <laughs> uh, I'm rejuvenated. I got the itch off my back. Got some foam off. I'm out. I'm gonna holler at y'all. <laughs> ah, ah. Fly, sea biscuit, fly! <laughs> so, what did you think of High Wing? No, no, I don't lie. I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Mm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and Highwing cross paths? It's a longer story, but I rescued her from poachers a few years back. Mm -hmm. Got her to safety and, well, she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry they could get her again, and that I might not be there next time. Professor Howen mentioned the poachers as well. She seemed to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't often agree with Professor Oh Howard. my goodness. But on that, I fear she's right. They want me to do this shit. The coach's influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. You're trying to get his money. I'm just not sure what. That does seem strange. Sounds as if they're planning something. Mm -hmm. Exactly. I'm going to go ruin their brain. I think I'm to look into it. Find out what's going on. What they're doing. Boy, you crasher. That's our new mix that coming out party crasher. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep Highwing safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh. Yeah, because I ain't doing well. that. I will. You got that. I should be going, but I got more we'll things on my check list though. Like go fuck these hoes. <laughs> <laughs> Can I help you with something? 
Hello, Lord Gok. Sorona said I might find you here. She did, did she? Did she send you with news? No, actually, I wanted to speak with you. It's about Ranrock. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am. Oh. And I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to, so I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Mm. Sorona trusts me, and she thought our interests may be aligned. Yeah, I'm with that. Well, if Sorona trusts you, very well. I may know of something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Mm -hmm. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. Mm -hmm. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. Very well. Yeah, we're I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need, and meet me near the witch's tomb. Well, I'll be down. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young I friend. did do one of the things, but I guess the Hogwarts caretaker at your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Bet you Although did. I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I'm I man, suppose babe. you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not. And uh, from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. Really? In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. What do you need? Do you see that curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. Damn, that was fast as hell. Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Go on, take the moon. Oh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed, which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Okay. Ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. Yeah. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart. Or, or shapeshifter, if A boggart. Uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. This one took the form of a demiguise. A demiguise? Who <gasps> there? Yes! Terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Korea? Uh, those statues are demiguises. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired place. Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. Okay. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. Mm -hmm. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmede has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them so uh, I can go about my evening duties. 
Fuck it. I'd be glad to help you, Mr. Moon. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However, will you get in? Hmm. Alahamora, that's how. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, curfew, tosh. schmurfew. I sent you a bit like me when I was your age. And I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. Oh, and thank you. Okay. <sighs> you doing? Can't try to sabotage me for a second. Wait. Oh, okay. Okay. Hello, Hamora. Okay, uh, it was nice that I kind of like explained your boy. What am I doing? Okay, the move is the sparks and rotation. I want to both cost my ideas are accurate. Reach the lock. I guess you just gotta move your thing around and do things. Well done! You're in! Remember, use a disillusionment charm so no one claps eyes on you. This is a restricted area of the castle after all. Yeah, I know that. And hence me unlocking the door. Oh, shit! Hello, Amora. Oh, let me get this right here. I'm pretty sure eventually level two and three gonna get harder. Oh, is that noise? Go ahead and check it out. Oh. Not at the moment, no. Plenty of other perils and pitfalls to send them my way, though. Well, I suppose I should begin my rounds now. Well, you know who I am. Well, I'm still guys. Hello, Mr. Moon. I have the moons you asked me to collect. Oh, goodness! You're as fearless as I'd hoped. Oh. An excellent Woo! start. If we can collect more, it may shed some light on who's behind all this. Of course, I first suspected Peeves. He drove the previous caretaker, rancorous carp, to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery. Mm -hmm. But that does not explain the bogger in Oxmead, does it? No, oh, come on. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. Um, it's not like a personal problem. I got nothing to do with that guy. 
What? What's going on? You <laughs> that was my ass. I'm done. I'm done. I wasn't even chasing oh, him. I wasn't even chasing him. <laughs> I wasn't even chasing him. <laughs> <laughs> Have a beautiful time!